Hi, welcome to Rick Snyder's Washington, where you get the whole story here on YouTube. And I got a baseball tale for you for once. You know, when Rob Gronkowski caught a football 600 feet up from a helicopter the other day, uh, I thought, okay, interesting story, but I got a better one for you in Washington. There's a ball dropped from the top of the Washington Monument to a Washington Senator's catcher. Now, supposedly this had been done before. In 1894, uh, a player from Chicago named William Shriver uh, supposedly caught a ball. Well, the Washington Monument was finished in 1884, so okay, I guess it's possible. Couldn't find much else on that. But in 1908, two fans bet the Senator's catcher, Gabby Street, that he couldn't catch a ball that they dropped from up there. Now, at all, the reports say 555 feet. But, and that's how tall the Washington Monument is. But the windows are at 500 feet. And back then, they had windows you could open. Um, and unfortunately, people jumped out, so they stopped doing that. You can't do that anymore. But they're at 500 feet. And there's no way that anybody climbed the top of that, you know, Washington Monument to get up to the 555 feet. And so it's, I think it's 500, but that's a minor thing. Let's do the story. Uh, there was no uh, limit on how many balls it took. I've heard various versions of this story, um, including that he caught two. But the, why would he catch two? Because the bet was about one. And they had limitless chances, I guess. So supposedly on the 15th try, uh, Gabby catches the ball. This thing is going, they figured out, 300 miles of force, pounds of force. So, you know, think how much that's falling on you. And it came at 95 miles an hour. Now he's used as a catcher to getting... Balls like that from Walter Johnson. So he could do that. 300 pounds of force. So, woo. So one of them terminal velocity things you learn in science class. So interesting about that. So it was basically collected the 500 bucks, which back then was some money uh, on there. Now, I've learned as a tour guide to always follow. What's the, keep going with the story. Because sometimes they're even better when you keep going. And so uh, Street didn't play a lot of baseball in the end. And by 1918, he has joined the U.S. Army. And he says, I'm going to go fight in the real world series. And he's one of the first 50,000 U.S. soldiers to hit France. And he would be in three major engagements of World War I, including Argonne, which is considered really one of the big ones. And he is shot in the leg by a passing German plane. What? A German machine gunner. We've all seen the movies. He got shot in the leg. <laughs> Talk about random. And so that ended his military uh, time. And he came back to the U.S. and he would be a player manager in the minors for a number of years. Probably 1930, he catches a royal break and he gets to be St. Louis's manager. And that's a good team. He had an owner that liked to fire managers. He, um, you know, Gabby was the fifth one in five years. So, but he held on. They they won the uh, league pennant in 1930. Then they won the World Series in 31. But by 1933, everybody was yelling and complaining about things, and he was gone. He would manage again in 1938 uh, with the St. Louis Browns. And he would pass away in 1951. Uh, really interesting story. I'd like to hear more about this guy. Uh, then I can tell you more about this guy. But anyway, certainly an interesting tale. That's the kind of stuff we talk about here on Rick Snyder's Washington, away from the two-minute limits of other places. So please like, share, and subscribe. A lot of you have done it. We're almost up to 1,100 followers here. I appreciate it. And I'll keep coming back with more stories. It's draft week. At Kentucky Derby is later this week. I'm going to be picking the Derby, talking about that. Um, so lots of good stories this week. Make sure you follow through. And look over on Twitter and the other social medias for the Daily Report. I'm Rick Snyder for Rick Snyder's Washington. Thanks for coming. See you again soon.